Hi, my name is Eric Lindberg, Lead Technical Advisor with Rainbow EcoScience. And today, I'm going to show all of you how to treat a large ash tree with our QConnect system. Now, our QConnect system typically comes with 10 T's. And here at Rainbow EcoScience, we suggest to use one T for every two inches of BBH. And so that gives you enough T's to treat about a 20 inch ash tree. Sometimes you can stretch that a little bit more if you're in a pinch, but we typically like to abide by that. Now in this particular case, today we have a 32 inch ash tree. So I'm gonna show you a couple different ways on how you can tackle this. So the simplest way to go about this is to add or remove tees as needed for the size of the tree. In this case, what we're gonna do is add on some trees and it's easy enough. You push on this push connect, pull out that piece, and then you take your as many tees as you need, push this in, you'll feel it kind of latch in there, and then you would go ahead and complete the harness system after you've added the, as many tees as you need, and then you're ready to go. What if you are in a situation where you do not have additional tees and you only have one Q-Connect system and you're treating a larger tree? Well, one of the ways that you can go about this is by taking the DBH. In this case, we have a 32 inch tree. We know that we wanna have 16 injection sites on here. So what I'm going to do is have eight tees on the Q-Connect system and I'm gonna treat half of the tree as a single line. I'm not going to complete that harness system. And with that, I'm only going to put in half of the product. So I'm gonna be treating this in two different parts. The nice thing about the Q-Connect system is you can have this in a straight line and you don't need to worry about product coming out at the other end because it's closed off at that spot. So after you have completed the first half of the tree and that's all done injecting, we're gonna go ahead and do the second half of the tree. And so repeating that same exact process just on the other side. Okay, so another way that you can go about treating a tree larger than 20 inches with one Q-Connect, if you only have you know, those 10 T's, is by completing the harness system with half the number of T's that you would typically use. So in this case, we have a 32 inch tree, typically would use 16 T's, 16 injection sites on here. So I've set up this Q-Connect system with eight T's on it, and I'm going to put in, uh, inject half of the product in eight of these holes, and then after that completes, I'm going to put an injection site, and move the T's over about two inches or so in between these spots, and I'm gonna inject it with the other half of the product. That way, we can make sure that we have adequate distribution throughout the entire canopy. So those are a couple of ways to treat a tree larger than 20 inches, some of those large trees. Now the easiest and preferred way is to just add on additional tees so you can get that uh, every tee for every two inches of DBH ratio. But if you're in a pinch and you only have that one Q-Connect system, these are some of the ways that you can go about it. If you're interested in learning more, feel free to contact us and we'd be happy to set up a demo and show you how to do these.